his best finish ever at the lacrosse fairground speedway we're going to take away the word mid-pack it's bill niles All right, here we go. Dan, that was a heck of a race. How did you call it and stay so calm? Well, you know, I, I thought on lap 14 I was going to throw one of the valves out of my throat. And I was really trying to hold back. OJ saved me on the restart. Got the 50-50 out of the way. I got to pull into the pits, a quick splash of water, and the race was back on. I was fine. Ah, excellent, excellent. What did you think of them last couple of laps there with that 50 and that 54 going at it? I'm, I'm still sweating. I'm sweating as much as you. I didn't drop as many pounds as you did tonight, but I'm still sweating. Oh, all right. Great, great, great call, Dan. Great call. Bill Niles, best finish ever at the Trust Fairgrounds Speedway. You know, one of the most interesting calls we were trying to determine was on the restart. We kind of figured Mike would take that lower line. What was going, What was your thought process on the restart of which lane you want to choose? There wasn't any doubt. Uh, there wasn't much of an outside groove. Mike got a great jump at the start of the feature. Uh, and there, there just wasn't an outside groove. Brent tried to get me a couple of times on the outside. He just, he just couldn't hang there, and you, you saw that on the restart, so... I figured uh, my tight car, stay on the inside. If I get a shot at him in the last couple of laps, lucky me. If I don't, hey, I'll take second or third. I'll be happy. All right, best feature finish. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, this this week's shout-out is to all my homies up at turn one, 95-7. Rock on, folks. You're going to hear him on this. I can't wait to hear this blast over the radio airwaves for the next week or so. Best finish ever in a lane model. Give it up, Bill Nye.